Sam Bradford, what what is his learning curve right now? What is he going through to go from the Peterson offense in Philadelphia, the Andy Reid offense in Philadelphia, to all of a sudden be thrown into the North Turner offense in Minnesota to get ready? What's he going through? First right of now? all, Peterson's West Coast, and I believe that was his first time in a West Coast type of offense. I'm gonna say he had something similar with Pat Shermer when Shermer was the coordinator in St. Louis. Mm -hmm. Um, before Shermer went to Philly, before he then now is in Minnesota, which mm -hmm. now Bradford has followed him there. But um, if, uh, if, if I'm thinking about all the coordinators he's been through, um, the fact that he has Shermer there to kind of like guide him through the similarities of, of what this is. And, and I'm going to say that he has one of the best quarterback whisperers. You know, I know we talk about Bruce Arians in this like this, but Norv Turner... Um, Norv is unbelievable at, at, at helping quarterbacks get the most out of what they have. And um, I think he's going to be able to call plays and be effective. He won't be able to make adjustments, uh, changing plays, putting them in the right plays. They'll be stuck with call it, run it plays, and that's it. So, if he plays compared to Sean Hill. So would you play? Sam Bradford against the Titans. If if he can get us lined up and and do what he needs to do, yes, because his ex getting him up to speed is going to help this offense a lot more than Sean Hill. And I'm only saying this because um, I know knock on Sean Hill. Uh, it, listen, man, you've made a lot of money as a backup in this league. Um, but I've seen this story before. Sean Hill will look great. He'll come in for your for your starter if he gets hurt. And then those interceptions, they come. And they come at a, at a rapid pace. So, but if he can give you one good game, maybe you do this now and Bradford. It's not about one good one good win with Sean Hill is not worth getting Bradford the experience in his offense huh. with the receivers, the running back in this system. It's just not worth it. So, do you think Bradford's going to start Sunday against um, the Titans? I, I don't know, I know where he, I don't know there. if he can get it if he can get everybody lined up. He should be able to understand the terminology. They run the same offense we ran, which is where uh, in St. Louis. Okay, they ran. They run. Norv and Mike March ran the same office. They worked together in Washington before Mike came uh, to uh, to St. Louis when I got there. Um, and that system, I found out of all the systems, the different systems that I ran, it's a number system. So if you call a play, the play is, uh, it's, let's go, uh, uh, I write, uh, you call a protection, 585. So you know there's a five here, eight here, five here, and then you tag it telling the backs to swing or hook or curl. That's easy for a quarterback compared to the West Coast system, two jet flanker drive. I mean, you just know the flanker doing the drive. Everybody else has to remember what they're doing, and you have to remember what they're doing instead of understanding how the system is called. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.